So sustainability is a societal response to how we bring together those challenges and those relationships we have with the past, in the present and into the future. I'm interested in sustainability because um, I think it's really important to mitigate climate change and I also think that it's important for our future generations to have the same opportunities that we did and this would mean to leave the earth in the same state that we found it. For my undergraduate I did archaeology and ancient civilizations but I had a, I've always had a real passion for the natural world, it was what I loved as a kid. Um, I was obsessed with David Attenborough documentaries and I think anybody who loves the natural world has really progressed can see how relevant sustainability is now. So with my masters I changed to looking at a more kind of life rather than death and really wanted to explore my passion for the living world and how I can protect it and help it in the future. How I define sustainability is probably what I see as most important within it is um, the continuation of humanity but balancing the needs of humans with natural needs. Um, so understanding the value of the natural world and protecting that value whilst also making sure that the basic needs of humanity are met um, and making sure you can work out new methods um, and solutions to kind of help that. It's important because it helps to protect ecosystems and um, maintains our quality of life. I'm really interested in the role the built environment has in relation to sustainability. So I'm interested in how historic buildings represent embodied carbon and also how we can adapt historic buildings for future uses. I've got students at the moment who are working on some of the buildings owned by the University Estate and thinking about their retrofit options. So what works could happen on a range of buildings to make them be adapted for future use. The university has a new approach to sustainability, a real sort of uh, drive around sustainability at the moment, really focusing in on the social and cultural aspects of sustainability as well as the environmental aspects of sustainability. So I'm hoping to feed into that work through my focus on the built environment and really thinking about how the buildings that we teach and work in, how they can contribute to the future sustainability of the university. The university the university um, offers environment and ethics roles in their college committees and um, with the student union. Um, I'm an environment and ethics officer for my college and I've been able to run sustainable events for students. Um, they also offer like volunteering uh, positions like sustainability auditing and um, sustainability champions where students can connect with the local community and local businesses with the aim to improve sustainability. Because of my course I'm learning about sustainability and I think I'm probably quite biased in that aspect. I get a lot more opportunity from the university because of that, um, just in general learning. Um, even some of my modules which are less related there's always that aspect of sustainability is brought in. Um, and then of course there's um, like volunteering and learning opportunities provided by the university to kind of take that interest further um, and career aspects as well so I, they do provide a good level of it. That something that would improve the university's sustainability would be for the university to not indirectly fund fossil fuels. Some of the companies that they invest in, like banks, like Barclays, um, fund fossil fuels. So I think that if they divest from this, that would improve the sustainability. So I know the university puts a lot of effort into um, sustainability and reaching sustainability goals and kind of reaching net zero carbon emissions by 2030. Um, but 
but you know there's always that step further you can go um, making sure that it continues to be a green campus that they continue to prioritize that um, where they allow other forms of transport to become easier to use for students like bikes and some of the electric scooters and bikes that they've got around the campus um, and just you know making sure they're relying on those renewable energies and moving away from carbon emission energies and other less renewable ones. Um, another way that they could improve sustainability is to reform and monitor their su supply chains. This could be done by looking at where they get their food supplies for catering and looking for more sustainable ways to get these um, food supplies. Um, I also think that there should be more representation for student voices higher up in the more sustainable decision making processes. I think that there is work for the university to do to bring together all of the teaching and all the research that's already happening within sustainability but sometimes that feels like it's a little bit in specialist areas whereas actually the majority of staff are working on aspects of sustainability whether that's in the past, in the present or thinking about some of those future solutions.